Dum dum dum. We got fish. I'm gonna go look at it. You you not seen it. I know you have. I know she can't see it. Hit the buzzer. There you go. Oh man, look at it, y'all. Baby is beautiful. Who can't touch it? I can look at it, but I can't touch it. Wow. We back. We back. I thought it was a game. It's here. Hey. Hey, we off. All right, here we go. Yeah, we in this thing. My bus is here. Y'all see it? It's scary. Here, uh, give her the keys to my car. Tell her, yeah. Let me show sure y'all, we live. It's, it's, it's here. I'm here now. Let me show y'all my brand new possession. Here we go, look at this thing. Oh, yeah, because I'm asked for a different color. Oh, tow truck here. Put it back. Man. Look at it. Oh, shit. Yeah, now that was, that was crucial, y'all. We here, baby. How I feel? You know what else, Ben? What? The tires were low. They didn't help. Yeah. When you put air in tires, have to switch and lift up like two or three inches. So that way, when it does get towed, ain't, ain't no issue. Yeah, we had to push the bus all the way up this hill so he could tow us. But it's worth it. And watch, he gonna put the ramp, we nigger rigging it. He gonna put the ramp right there. And then we gonna drive the bus backwards all the way onto the tow truck. Ben, what's up? What's that is, if the bus scratches, you get to your house. Can't be mad, it's gotta get it fixed. It don't matter, the bus is here now. You get money. Like, like a deli truck type thing. Good job, man. It's a food truck. Yeah. I had a custom made from China. This is the beginning of Lee Tank Motors. We're an electric food truck company. Really? So when you see Lee Tank Motors, understand that's, that's Mass Influence Media. We have electric, 100% electric, battery operated, no gas, food truck. You ready? I, 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 hold the window. Hold the window. <laughs> uh, the bottom of course. Hey, Miss Chantel, this is the bus right here. 20 foot long. Let's go all the way around it so you can see it. 20 foot long. I've already put my mirrors on. I've already drove it down the street. The awning is hanging right here. As you see, the awning is already connected and installed. The awnings were installed already. So I'm gonna go on the inside of the truck. All right, first thing that, that they messed up on is they didn't finish this sink. They didn't add the sink at all right here. They didn't finish the sink and they didn't leave me no jug or plumbing. That's number one for this. What they did do is they did give me cabinet space. Where you didn't have cabinet space, they added these little fake door, uh, marble doors, and they gave me counter space. So now I have stuff to hide underneath here and on every little bottom, every bottom, see? They added also, they added this right here. This right here is good and it looks good or whatever. Like it's cool, but they can't have this in here because we'll, we'll remember for health code purposes, you got to have a slip resistant four, which is this right here. This is not slip resistant. So I'm, they, I'm going to have to pull that, pull, I'm going to have to pull this up so they can be down to the metal. All right. Next thing, 
right here, I would say, all, just, just like on yours, they have all these out. So that means you're gonna have to run your hose and run your hose through there or hide your hose right here. But just the fact that this, this is a hazard. This, this, this will hit somebody knee. Somebody knee right here will get hurt hitting this right here. So this is a one, two, three, four. Four of the four heaters have this right here. All right, so then you have I have a big overhead light right here. It's my light switch to make these come on right here. All right, since we on the roof, as you can see, you see how they added paneling? Look at this. They hit all, all the cords are hidden. All the cords are hidden. All the cords are hidden. This right here is my LED screen on the outside of the truck right there. All the cords are hidden. You see this? And then they, they, they gave me some kind of wall paper or something. Um, what else we got in here? Um, they got this inverter right here. They have yeah, this, this empower inverter. Uh, they already in the truck. They had this exhaust right here, automatic exhaust, pull smoke out right here. That exhaust. Um, I do have my double freezer. The double freezer's right here. Double freezer. And then also, what else do I have? And that is actually, I have my AC unit. So the only thing I'm missing inside of this truck is actually a hood, a hood to go over the food and stuff right here. So that's the only thing you're missing is the hood. Hood, hood for the food and that's it. And which I'm leaving that for the customer to pay for. And that's the only fi final thing they have to add. It drives, batteries are already intact. It is ready to go and hit the market. The awnings are on. Let's get this baby sold to whoever they can get it on. It can fit on a regular size. It can fit on a regular size tow truck. So if they have a regular tow truck, it can fit on a regular 20 foot bed tow truck. That's how I got here. Uh, and yeah, I'm fully charging to see how fast we can go with it. But as far as that, everything else is good. I got a, I got a radio already installed. I got it charging right here. And yeah, so that's it, Chantel. We we went from selling selling controllers, we went from sell, selling all this stuff, selling this to now we selling trucks. Let's get it. All right, on the real talk, right? Yeah. The next step to do is is buy some better fry pans and sell them. But I like Chantel had this. No, Chantel had she more had, shit. She, she had that. No, I understand that, but that's bullshit too. Compared to like extra cookware. Yes, ma'am. Little baby. Hello. Hello. Yeah, we live in this thing, y'all. Check this out.